but the house looks nice. Um, this is a state highway. Did you know that? And Harlem Avenue, do you hear me? Yes, yes. Harlem Avenue was 42A. The A was for alternate. And I grew up pretty much from the time I was two years old in Oak Park, except at times I lived in Florida. Mm. Uh, Florida, understunk, you know that word? No. Well, you, I had some German ancestors, and uh, Unterstank <laughs> means kind of goofy. Oh. Uh, no, I'll tell you, that what's happening in the country is we have to hire Negroes, and they think they're getting away with it. Oh, my and gosh. And the courthouse in, in particularly Orlando and Florida needs to be checked out. I went to school. For what, Negroes? They like to arrest women, and <gasps> women aren't taking that shit anymore. <laughs> this seems crazy. All the stuff that, that's going on. Oh, I don't hear at all. Yeah, it just seems anyway, crazy. Anyway, listen. That street, when I came here over 50 years ago, it's not a street. It's a dead end to the lake. Oh, yeah, right. And it's a dead end to Cedar Street, which is an old, which is a Highland Park Street. Cedar. And just the front part is on Sheridan, so that would be State Highway. Mm. So it's a combination of State Highway and City Street of Highland Park. You, Mr. Kleinman, did the checking on it because we bought the lot and we wanted to know what was over there. And all those bushes over there, somebody came in and thought they could plant them and pick up some big money. And I suspect someone in Washington did it. Oh. I, sus I, I do not trust the president because you just don't suddenly become president without going into the Chicago Stadium. Right. I agree. Uh, and and uh, I'll tell you what probably brought you here. I told somebody that... <laughs> that I did not get my breath. The black boys, I didn't say, this is very, the black boys, I just said the basketball players are going to teach basketball in Africa. And the black people are falling over. We'd get a whole lot of them back there. Back in Africa? In, oh, pardon? Africa? Africa, yeah. I think they all think they can freeload into the United States, and I think they can't. And we'll check into that. We'll check into that. You, you ch check it out, yeah. The, the, this road is no joke. It's not 41. Oh. The road that was 41 is Skokie Highway, and 41. This pe these right. people used to drive all the way to Miami on it. Okay. And we drove to Miami many, many times because we had lived there. Mm. I still have a sister on Bay Harbor. They think they can take the mortgage and take the house and then build a skyscraper here. Oh, and man. And there's an old Spanish saying, the way Jose. Oh, ho, ho. yeah, I All think right. I've heard that. And and this is in the wrong place. It leaks and freezes the wall. But that's okay. I, I'm going to call Sandy. I man. think I still have a baseball bat. Oh. I had a son. This is strange, man, and I will tell you because it's very important. Okay. I had a son. He was my oldest. He was born 
believe it or not, in the hospital on Miami Beach. Oh. Very, very classy. And um, he went to school here over to Virginia School, finished uh, in very, oh, and then they eventually graduated from Highland Park High School, except they told me he was dead. They told me he was hit by the train, and I about collapsed, because he was running back and forth between two houses. His father had first moved over to Pleasant Avenue, and um, I later saw him on television. He was not hit by a train. He had a restaurant on, down in Chicago, and this is the truth. I wouldn't go down there to see because my husband, Mr. Kleinman, lost two relatives who were probably poisoned in a restaurant and fell over on the floor. And I wasn't going to be the third one. No way, I, Jose. This is not recent. This is quite a while ago. My husband's father and his in law, his uncle's wife, fell over in Chicago restaurants and died. And I, I believe, and I've talked about it to the Highland Park Police, and boy, they sure didn't argue with me. <laughs> and, um, oh, 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 I took. Uh, when the Highland Park police were here, I took one of them like this, and I walked them way back. Oh, you asked what? Waterproofing. Oh, well, water. Oh, okay, I walked one of them way back there because I was cleaning up way back. This land goes back 300 feet. You hear me? Yes. And, but it, it comes through kind of a point. And I found a place, because I read something in the paper, that the human body is 80% water, and if you bury it, it sinks to the water drain. I found two holes in the back, and I quit working back there when I saw this, and I showed it to the Highland Park Police. And I told them, Bachi was my gardener who is now cutting the lawn. If you need help, you can check with him.